Uh, we're doing a video, and just judging by that, uh, I'd say you're doing Madagascar for eighth grade. What made y'all choose this country? Well, it was either that, it was actually, or like, uh, the, like, it was our final decision. We had to pick against one, and then it was kind of like rock paper. It was either Madagascar or Kuwait. Yeah, yeah. So majority yeah. rules. Yeah, so Madagascar won. So give me about 30 seconds of interesting facts about this, and what do you have to present? Okay, Madagascar has about 20 million people, which is about five Georgias, five, five times the Georgia people. Literally, yeah, just about the size of Texas. Um, let's see. Okay, their main religion is Christian, Muslim, or Islamic, and the traditional religion, which they didn't give us. Uh, 55% are traditional religion, um, 40% is uh Christian, and the remaining five is uh, Muslim or Islam. Katie, it's the French and Malagasy. Can you tell me something? Uh, one of their fun facts is that since people came in, 90% of their forest or nature has been driven away because of us. Depleted. Depleted. And, the, and the famous elephant elephant bird, it, it, it got it's extinct. It's extinct now. It's, its egg was about as, as the size of uh, a man's head. Yeah, that's I like your trifold, too. Uh... All that information and more up there. And what uh, what kind of food do you have? We have animal crackers for like the animals. We have cookies, like yeah. fish, yeah. Fish, yeah. And, and a dessert, which is Ooh. fruit, yeah. vanilla extract, lemon juice, sugar, and salt. And also, 60 to 50 million years ago, uh, uh, Madagascar broke off from Africa and it spent another 45 million years drifting. Just drifting. Good old continental drift there. All right, well done. Right. Kuwait, and what grade chose Kuwait? Seventh it was grade. seventh grade. Give me a quick sixty-second breakdown of Kuwait. Uh, Kuwait is between Iraq and Saudi Arabia. It's off the Persian Gulf, and the capital is Kuwait City. And they also have like their buildings and stuff is very cool. Like here, look up here. They have very yeah, yeah. Cool and the architecture and the towers. Yeah, and then over here we have some fun facts. Kuwait's official, uh, Kuwait's official name is State Kuwait. Kuwait is one of the smallest countries in the world. Kuwait gained its independence on June 19th, 1961. Kuwait's main food supply is mostly rice. And in 1963, Kuwait became a part of the United Nations. All right, nice job on the trifold. Very good. There's Kuwait. What do you have to present? Little flag. Food tomorrow. Whoosh. All right. Thanks, Kuwait. All right. Jamaica, man. So uh, tell me, it means it's sixth grade. Sixth grade. Tell me something about Jamaica. The Jamaican culture is very Jamaican motto is out of many one people. And a Jamaican, the fastest person in the world is from Jamaica. Uh, um, Jamaican jerk sauce was made when Colo um, Christopher Columbus came over to Jamaica. He he makes uh, he makes a bunch bunch of things together to put on his chicken, and soon became the spicy jerk sauce. Awesome. Well, nice job on your trifold, too, gentlemen. And uh, what do you? Presenting or I guess giving away here. Uh, banana, um, banana pudding. Banana? No, not banana. Bread pudding. Bread pudding. Bread pudding. Jerk, uh, chicken, and Jamaican coconut. All this good food must be a popular exhibit to come see. So, yeah. nice job, six.
And we have our social studies teacher live on hand here. Uh, some comments about what you see about all these countries here? Mr. I Meyer? think the information is fantastic and the food is better. <laughs> well done, Tom. Who gets the award for best food? Well, my class, of course. Of course. Good old Jamaica there. I concur.